What up, YouTube? Timu is here. Now, here is my review for Dave Fincher's 2014 film, which, by the way, was his last film before he did Mank. But, here's my review for his 2014 flick, Gone Girl. Now, I remember watching this film uh, when it got released all the way back in, uh, in 2014. It is, of course, based on a, uh, based on a book, you know, written by, uh, Jillian Flynn, starring, uh, Starring Ben Affleck, who plays this a uh, New York-based uh, writer named Nick Dunn, uh, who has a uh, you know um, who has a wife named Amy Dunn, who ends up going missing, and lots of public are wondering if uh, Nick had like anything to do with it and all that, like had anything to do with her murder and all. Uh, this movie let okay, it's a bit hard to really talk about this film without giving any spoilers away, but holy cow. Gone Girl is the reason why lots of people don't even want to get married no more. You know, uh, Gone Girl is is one of Fincher's most messed up films. Uh, but Gone Girl is awesome. It ended up being in my top 20 favorite movies of 2014. I don't think it was in my top 10, but it was in my top 20. Gone Girl is hands down terrific. Uh, Rosemont Pike, of course, got a, a Best Actress nomination for her performance as Amy Dunn. Of course, their marriage, you know, ends up pretty much falling apart here and there. It also is on Hulu. Nice. Uh, you also had some other interesting, like, castles here. Uh, you had Neil Patrick Harris, who plays, like, uh, pretty much this pervert who, uh, is smitten with Amy Dunn. Uh, you even had Todd Perry was in the, I mean... When they first announced that Neil Patrick Harris and Tyler Perry was going to star in this, I was like, really? Perry and Harris? I mean, Bonnie from uh, How I Met Your Mother and uh, Medea are appearing in this? That, that sounded a bit odd at first. But then I saw the film and I was like, holy cow, Neil Patrick Harris and Tyler Perry completely surprised me of how good they was in this. You also had uh, Kim Dickens was in this. Uh, Emily Wachkowska, uh, I think that's how you pronounce her name. She was great. Carrie Coon, Patrick Fugit. Uh, you know, you had uh, Casey Wilson, uh, Sal Ward, Lola Kirk, Boyd Holbrook was in this, Scoop McNary, uh, Missy Pyle, Kathleen uh, Perkins. You guys have really solid supporting cast list. But the marriage scene, like... The marriage between, of course, uh, Affleck and, um, and Rosemark Pike's characters ends up getting pretty messed up. Uh, their relationship seemed pretty good at first, but then it takes a rocky turn. Uh, once, you know, she ends up getting, uh, of course, when she ends up, uh, going missing. And, oh boy, um, Gone Girl is just one messed up film. Uh... The twist at the end, I, I remember watching the film and did not even see that twist coming. Uh, I, I mean, I never read the book, so I don't know if the twist is even in the book or not. But, yeah, Gone Girl is one heck of a film. It's really entertaining. Uh, the mystery aspect was really cool to watch. I, I just love this movie. It's terrific, hands down. Uh, great performances by Affleck. I could have done without seeing his junk, but other than that, yeah, Affleck was still pretty solid in this. Um, Rosamund Pike, I I've always had a crush on Rosamund Pike, I I but I feel like Gone Girl is really, like, Rosamund Pike has said stuff before Gone Girl, but I feel like it's Gone Girl that really put Rosamund Pike on the map for most people, and she was terrific. If you guys never really seen Gone Girl, it's on Hulu, give it a shot, uh, the box office, it did pretty well in the box office, too. Let me pull up the box office results. It made about uh, 307.3 um, million. Did pretty well. Uh, it has a 87% um, Rotten Tomatoes. Not bad right there. So, yeah, definitely go check out uh, Gone Girl if you guys have never seen that. Anyway, let me leave with you guys. Have you ever seen Gone Girl? If so, uh, what you thought of it? Did you like it? Did you not like it? You know, ever read the book it's based on? Uh, drop comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for more notifications. This is Timu Sayang.